Yo, what's going cool with y'all over there and these flamethrowers? Abs and K-Trap was playing around with them. Yeah, what's good y'all? Back at it again with another reaction. This time we have Chip. And I'm pretty sure after those last two tracks that he did, that this one is going to be a banger. Because he has a project coming out. I'm seeing the names on this one. But yo, I don't want to hold y'all too much longer. Let's get it. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What they just did with the beat just now, that was different. That caught me off guard. Let's run it back a little bit. So over it, I'm really not too much of a fan of this hook. Like I get it, but this this let man know from the get go. Fair to three birds when I let go. Fall to the floor when I let go. Fall to the floor like techno. He's alright, not the best though. Come on site, take the check now. Them and I cool, but who cares? Take no prisoners, let go. Sexy gal on my arm, look. Say no crap when I step look. Gal on me. Alright, at some point they're gonna have to drop this whole fire thing, cause it's just not working here. It's 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 not. I it's 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 not for me. It's reminding me of like the old school grime tracks where they do that like serious. I don't know why it's sounding better with JME than it did with Chip. Granted, I still don't like the sample that they're using to say fire. It just feels so just out of place. Like the monotoneness is, but I don't know. I guess because I've heard so many different songs where JME does that kind of approach where it's like a repeating word or whatever, it just sounds different with him. But with Chip, I wasn't really feeling it after like the first couple reps when he did the hook in the beginning. Uh, fantastic flame on, fantastic boy. Be a feature with my name on. Fantastic flame on. Spray a million bars and shower man. I'm Mario with the flower man. If I don't like my uh -huh, Mario with the flowers when he could start throwing fire. Flame on. Spray a million bars and shower man. I'm Mario with the flower man. If I don't like man, he's gone. From the NBA jam man, he's been on. The only time you see these on is when I dash it in the bun. Kim John Yo, what's going with y'all over there and these flamethrowers? Abs and K-Trap was playing around with them in their last video. These things are way too accessible. The only time you see these on is when I dash it in the bun. Kim Jong Un man I knew him. Dragon with Ken Show right you can. Ultra combo like Cinder. Kick scar like Simba. Inter. Try play me again. Flame. Cook daily again. End man's career when I see now. That switch up was hard. That was hard. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? Spray a million bars and shower man. He said, and like when I point like freezer, you don't ever want freezer to point at you, dogs. Ask Krillin. Try play me again. Flame, cook daily again. End man's career when I point like freezer or Alan Sugar. Man, get God. Fuck your single, that shit's not. Fuck your mixtape, that shit's not. Fuck yeah, this doesn't hit the same when he does it. That visual was cool. That was dope. What did it do with the visual? That was dope. Touch the mic and ignite that. Grab the gun, and light that. Cock back, man, can't stop that. Water 
of flows if you're asking. Went real black on the yachty in 01, caught the clap, my things was on. Should've been a rap, but I acted the prat and I went straight back, cause that bitch was. Yeah, I shouldn't talk like this, and the missus is gonna be pissed I'm playing with. A chip just sent me the rhythm, it's Chris, and it's one big list of everything. Set it off, I just wanna inspire. No, I'm not a watch, I still got that. I'm gonna retire and sit by the liar, liar, pants on. Man talk big on the net, pure. See him in the flesh, where's all that? Lyrical, physical, whole lot of cast, but minimal. Fuck your single, that sits not. Fuck your mixtape, that Jimmy had the best verse. Fuck your album, that sits not. Every time you hear chip drop, touch the mic and ignite that. Grab the gun, and light that. Cop back, man, can't stop that. Water flows if you've got that. <laughs> He's still lying, mics on fire. So in this channel we hold the vowels, that means we're gonna get straight into it. This one may not make some of y'all happy, but this one is a little bit below an eight for me. Now I really wanna preface the rest of this commentary by saying that these are three very legendary grime MCs, and this track just wasn't their peak potential, honestly. Now admittedly, I probably couldn't really take in pieces of this song the way I would want to, because I really disliked the sample that they used for the fire repeating in the background. This one just didn't measure up at all. And now that I'm playing everything back in my head, this beat actually just reminds me of like an alarm or something. Like this sounds like something that would go off in a building, like fire. 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 It just it just didn't do it for me. It was just kind of monotone. The voice really wasn't that cool. It, it just didn't really have the effect that they probably think it was gonna have. I don't know, it, it just didn't work out for me. JME did the best with it, but overall, that is what's really keeping me from being able to take in the rest of this song. Now with artists like these, I really expected way more out of them when it comes to the flow. It was enough to get by on the track, but this is probably one of those songs that when I'm listening to it on a project, I might listen to it that first time just to get through the project, but after that, I will probably skip it. Like, it just doesn't have anything that really makes me wanna play it over. The flows weren't that special. The beat didn't really have too much that really gravitated towards me. And then the fact that they used that sample just made it so much harder for me to digest. But lyrically, that definitely did save the track. Chip, after coming out of Flowers and Killer MC, I know what he can do, especially his track record in general. And this just wasn't it. He maybe had some moments in there that I probably didn't catch, but overall, it just wasn't really packaged in a way that I could really, really appreciate. And as I mentioned during the reaction, there are songs that I've heard in the past where they do have that thing where it's something that's being repeated throughout the whole song. They're tying in their lyrics into that thing. But this just wasn't a good execution of that particular concept. Concept. Jamie was definitely the star in this one. I don't know what it is about his voice and his flow that made this one just feel so much better using that sample, but everybody else, it was just like, eh. If I had to rank them, it was Jamie, Dizzy, and then Chip in terms of who I personally preferred on this particular song. And it's for all of those reasons exactly that this one doesn't really have a really strong replay value for me. I just don't really see myself wanting to play this song again, let alone tell somebody else to listen to it. At least not as their introduction to these artists. Maybe if I want to say, yo, listen to this, you know, it has a little bit of a concept that you might appreciate, but it's like introduce somebody, this isn't it for me. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. What are some of your favorite songs by these three artists? I know that they have a massive catalog and all of them have delivered some bangers over the years. So I'm curious to see what are some of the songs that y'all like. Hang tight for some more reactions. I do got more of those coming for y'all. But until next time, peace.